fire. Guys, what is with the fire? Put it out. Put it out. Come on. Get to it. Oh, fire. Hey folks, welcome back to Handyshire here in Kingdoms and Castles, a place that is in desperate need of ballasteers. <laughs> we got uh, we got ogred last time, so we need to get another couple of towers up that can uh, attack an ogre. That's probably out on more of an outer, probably comparable to this ring right here, so that it will have access to the middle and access to further out. So it could even be side by side with these guys, or at least with a few of them. Now, one thing I do want to do is we have been whittling away at the resources of this guy. So that needs to go away, and another one formed over here. And we took out the tree. Back out a little. Music's kind of loud. Took out the tree right here so we can get a road into this area. Let's do that first. Town, I want to see just how far I can reach into there. Where did that snow come from? If you went there, can I industry forester right there? That'll work. And what I was wondering is if it would expose and allow me to use the rest of the area out there. It looks like it will. At least it's trying to indicate that. We'll see if that is true or if I actually have to get a road all the way into here to do it. No, not ready for you guys yet. So that's going to happen over... The well, they got that in fast. So that's going to happen there. We... They're taking pity on us. <laughs> a full boat and the little rowboat were the last two that couldn't quite fit in there. Kind of tagged along. Yeah, there, there's a tow rope on the back. We're just kind of pulling them. Anyway, they're going to come in from this side thinking that they're going to get the, uh, the surprise on us, the drop on us. Not realizing we've got five towers. We're a five-tower town. Here they come. Let's follow them in. With the loud music. Ah, oh, the torch is back here. Um, two torches there. Ah, two torches with each boat. Four torches coming. We are following this guy, apparently. Alright, well, let's break away here. We'll just sit here and watch. Who? These guys are toast. They're toast. Ooh, this is a good place for them to attack. We're not going to even touch any of our buildings. Don't you, don't you, don't, no, no. Okay, come on, take them out. Don't get my well lit. There we go. We took them all out. They're leaving. They never made contact with us at all. Happiness is holding. It worked. Okay, that was our last easy raid. I'm going to say, here comes the plague. 15 peasants, and there goes the plague workers. I've seen pictures of plague workers. They have that mask. It has a big, long, hooked nose or mouth or something like a snout. It kind of looks like an animal, like a fox face. I'm trying to remember what I learned about that. But you see the, uh, let me zoom in here, the black sign over them that says they have the plague right there will turn green when the plague worker gets to them. And it'll go from death to a smiley face. Come on, there he is right there. He's working his way through the trees. And he got it. All right. So, the plague has not harmed us at all. Okay. Anyway, advisors, what have they got for us? Hmm. Sire, it took too long to get the harvest in. Hmm. And good day. Hmm. And good day. All right. That wasn't all that helpful. No congratulations on taking out the Vikings or anything. Sheesh. Um, a tower by each one of these guys. Our stone is off. We have eight idle workers. Okay. Let's get stone. We have stone working over there. Let's get stone working over here, too. So turn you on. And we'll leave the other four as constructors. I'm just looking things over. We have two charcoal going, and we have lots of charcoal. Let's turn one of these off. Now we have six people available. We did turn off all of these guys though. I do feel the need to at least get 
two of them going again. You and you. I don't know if... I assume that because there's two people employed there, they're going to walk out and get the supply and bring it in. I don't know if they're not employed, if others will bring things to it and leave, or if it just shuts down complete access to it. Now that I've turned that on, they seem to be walking over to get stuff, so... Hmm... Oh, man, no, those are probably employees coming to work. Okay, two idle people. So with that, stone is being produced, and let's build some towers. This is going to take up all of our labor for a long time, unfortunately. Five per is what it takes. But if we, let's see, pull that out so I can back all the way out. They're going to come in either from here or here or here. This is pretty immune, unless they were going to land over here and walk across the whole thing. And that is likely to happen eventually. But I would assume they're going to take the easy way in this early in the game. So let's let's couple up with these three towers. That one, this one, this one. And I think two of these will, make, will hit this one. I don't know if this one will. We'll find out. So let's castle, castle block... One, two, three, four, and Castle Ballista does not help that tower over there. We want to get those ogres with as much distance as possible to get as many shots in before they take us down. Let's go two more. Now, Ballista. And there's clouds. All right, try that again. That's pretty close. It's still not enough to help that one, though. I really want to be able to hit that square. I'd like to be able to hit that square, too, but we'll do that from this side. Before I add any more, though, that was six. Let's put four over here and see if this one can protect that tower. Or I could just put a tower in there and not worry about it. You know, I kind of like that better. Let's demolish... to there. My lights just flickered. Hmm. Better not lose power just as I'm recording this. This is this is going really well. Um, we could put up tower right here, but man, I take all the view out of that house. I mean, how do you resell a house without a view? Of course, you could say that about all these windows in here too. So let's. But that's a road right there. I guess I have no choice. That's got to be a tower. Okay, castle. Let's put four in here. And let's put in... Oh, what does the ballista want to do from here? He does hit both sides of that tower. The other tower over here is only going to hit about here now. So he's going to protect that one. And this one is not going to protect any. I'm thinking that's just too far away. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll go with that. We'll get those built. Let's take one ballista in. We may not get all three of them built, but we'll get at least working on one. So, we are using a lot of stone. We're not using a lot of wood. Let's steal some labor out of... That's not wood. You. In fact, you can go away. All right, you're done. But let's steal help out of here. Production halt. It can't store any more wood. Needs a stockpile. Interesting. Oh, the stockpile's off. That's why. Okay, well, yeah, same here. Okay, since you're not working anyway, I wonder if they would have been out working on constructing buildings had they not been able to do their job there. I wonder if the game is that smart yet. Don't know. I don't know if there's a way that I can click on this, two of two workers, and click on that in any way to find the workers and then take a look at whether you know what job they're working on at the time. Those are the sort of things I would like to see. Who is the Master Priest? But I can't go to them by clicking on anything. So, you're built. You're building. That was a Tower of Five. Let's go ahead and match it. Castle, block. No. For a minute I thought I was trying to build on that roof. You apparently are not. It's odd how it's not showing it right here. It acts like it's, well, one, two, 
three, four. There's three more clouds of dust there. Okay. So you are actually going to go one level higher. I see. So we're not going to match. This is where the other one goes. Where to? Market goes there. If we get into the market. Well, 7 of 75. Yes, we do need another market. Okay. Need another house soon, too. How's our food doing? Food's doing good. Need another house so we get more labor to do all these things. Do we do that right now real quick? I'm kind of thinking we do. Let's town... Let's do a manor. Let's put two manors in here. There and there. And we don't have the labor yet to even run all these farms. There's three farms not even running at the moment. So I'm thinking we already have enough food to run two manors. So let's just do it. They're going to they're gonna go in. Whoever moves in is going to employ the rest of the food as well as continue all the building projects. So let's lay the last of these towers, get everything laid, and then we will shut down jobs as we can to get the construction finished and just kind of micromanage it and get it done. And we'll just sit back and watch the uh, watch the show. So that didn't answer where this goes. What would go behind the houses? Another market, another tavern can go back in here. Uh, one person stayed. We're at 84 of 84. We almost had a death. Must be one death in there. Does he go along the side? Or does he come diagonal right here? We th talked about getting a road through here. To snag that one. That probably makes sense. So let's get that set before we lose it. That leaves there or there. Or something not even attached to it. Is there a single spot somewhere? I wanted to leave that open. Right there. We're not going to be able to protect this from here anyway. It's at five high. It's out of its reach. I have to go seven high to get there. Let's put it right here. Castle. And this takes 15 each, right? We don't have enough. Four. We'll go one more to five. Ah, oh, there it is. Castle. It is 15 stone and five wood. Okay. So that is all that laid. Um, Castle Ballista, one of you. And I need one more for here. Alright, so we need wood, which means I gotta turn... Hmm... I have to turn this back on. No. Charcoal 84. I have to turn this back on and this back on. That's charcoal in there. Well, we'll do it anyway. They just haven't used it up. It's supposed to only be lumber. Okay, so that is a working source of wood. We still have some in stock, but not much. It says 13. That looks like a lot more than 13 to me. And stone is really running low. We do have two quarries going. Don't have a lot more use for stone right now, though. So let's shut one of these guys down. I'm trying to find labor. So one stockpile, one quarry. One forester, one stockpile. What else can I steal labor from? Temporarily. Let's click on a uh, on a charcoal maker and an agriculture. Really? No medical piety? Grandmaster piety. Hmm. Do I unemploy this for a little while? I think not. But what can I? The church is happiness. I could do away with happiness for a little while. We could take the taxes down to balance that. Okay. Now we are aiming for 73. Up, oh, 85. Okay, that balanced out just right. Um, I want to put the other market in, but I can wait on that. Food, 500. We could shut down a group of farms and get the construction done. All right, we just harvested. Good, 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 good. Let's, and this guy's full, so they're all running that direction. Okay. Let's shut this group down for one year. Get all of this construction done. Hope it gets done before the next raid. Hmm. Too long to harvest. Yeah. Hmm. Peasants are very happy. Okay. 
And yeah, we're going to lose food here. But I have a feeling if I shut them down, they'll quit even trying, and we don't want to do that. So let's take all the food that we can get. We'll see it disappear when we get... Yeah, there it goes. Okay. You... In fact, let's just pause a second before they start to, uh, to use it. Let's shut all of you down. Right there. So there's nine workers plus a mill. Though I could leave running just the the two dark green squares. Oh well. There's ten workers. Alright. Turn that back on. That should get the rest of the construction done. And that gave us enough wood to get in, I think. Was it fifteen or was it uh, uh, was it twenty-five? Thirty-five. I need thirty-five wood for this guy. Okay. So, do I turn on one more? Well, he does me no good because I didn't put a, uh, a stockpile next to him. Do I have access to that? I do. Let's town road there, which opens up that square there for a stockpile. Right there. Which allows me to turn this on. Though not yet. i got to get the stockpile built. Is he already? He's not. He's building the road. They like building roads. Kind of like Banished. You lay down roads and you can just forget. Get anything else done. Alright, so what is happening in town? Because we've got a little time to kill. You know how in Farming Simulator you pass through a building. As soon as you touch it, you fire way over. And then you fire over and then you fire back. You know, the camera would bounce. Kind of wish this would do that. So I can bounce in around buildings and kind of travel through pathways. Church is off. Otherwise, when this harvests and starts up again, I probably need to turn this back. No, not necessarily. We were losing most of the harvest anyway, yet we're still okay. We we'll probably have all grandmasters in here now. So with that, we're built. All right, let's turn you. Clicky, clicky. There you are. Turn you on. Get more wood coming in. Otherwise, we'll leave everything else going. Stone is slowly returning. Uh, thir I need 35 wood to get this last one built. Otherwise, he's almost in. He is in. Okay. So, is he the one that is selected? He is. So, that is our range at this point. This one, 29 wood. Come on, let me have it. How is this one? Zero builders. After all that, I still... These are in. 113. We have a lot of people here. How come I can't find workers? What am I missing here? We shut down this whole complex. What was that? That's a dragon. That's a dragon. Uh-huh. Because I passed through a hundred citizens. That had to trigger all kinds of fun things. We'll get in here. Too bad I can't click on him and follow him. Oh, don't you be pausing there. Don't you be pausing there. Let me back up a little. Look at all those arrows. Ballista. Got him. And he didn't destroy anything. Nice. There he is. Okay. Successfully took out a dragon. Hmm. We got him, sire. Dragons are no match for our might. <laughs> Wait till the big one comes. And you are telling me that peasants grow unhappy. Churches are too crowded. Yeah. Ah, oh, you built it. That's what I needed to know. 55 wood. Last one in. Get builders assigned. And then we'll turn everything back on again. Castle. Ballista. Right there. Or one more tower. Actually, pa uh, you demolish. Let's go one more space higher. You go there, and you go there. I like that. Okay, we need to build more of those, but these three will be our, our beginning. So, with that, and he is not assigned yet, so I've got to get him assigned. 133 people, and we don't have somebody assigned to this job yet. What am I missing? We have enough building materials, otherwise it would not have allowed me to 
even do it is because they're assigned to the the tower below it and that's so it's not going to trigger the upper level which I assume I'm clicking on now hmm eager to sleep where are you you must be building in the tower hello boy it's hard to click on this where's the hitbox All right, right above it. There it is. That was hard to find. Okay, so we're still bringing supplies over, but that's all done, and we are assigned. All right, that's the last construction job, right? It is. So let's turn this town back on. Uh, two? One is running. Let's get the stone built up again. Let's get two of these running. And they filled right up. One of these is enough for now. Let me back up a little so the camera doesn't go so fast. And 53 charcoal. Let's get this guy up and running. Nobody jumped into it, but they will as soon as the builders are done. Food, 300. All right, let's fire this whole system back up. Um, let's do the good squares first. How do we determine that? High soil fertility. And it was, I want to say this one, medium, medium, was there only one in there? There it is, okay, you're first, now, this guy next, then the rest of them, just in case it works only in the order that I'm placing it, instead of the first job that's nearby or something like that. Those are all open. What else have I closed? This one I thought I hit. I guess I didn't. All right, there's the charcoal. Get that running again. Um, so we got the houses in. Do we have people living in them? We should. 133 of 134. One of our peasants died in a woodcutting accident. Um, there we are. 25 of 25. Happiness is 86. Church. Let's get the church back on. And though we've got to, oh, we're, we're employed. I wonder how it works as far as when it determines what job gets filled first. I wonder if somebody has the skills already to run the job if they get first pick. I wonder what's happening in the code behind the game. I wonder these things. I lose sleep wondering these things. Charcoal, 10 of 10. 11 of 10. Food, 35 of 30. Head of households, four of them. This is looking really good. How's the market doing? Two of 75, five people working it. Okay. So you are full. So this is not gonna hold much. This has room, but it takes a while to get to it. Hmm. I'm tempted to build another big one right here and get rid of that. So to force them to use this one instead of that one so that they have a, a short run and these guys don't have to go so far to empty this. As you can see, they're not doing it. They're not even getting there. Is there a way to get rid of the supplies inside? Or when you demolish it, does all that vanish? That's a 200 food experiment. We only have 200 food. Ouch. Well, let's get it built. We've got to do it. Um, we're not building houses in this area without building more services. Okay. Well, I'm sure we got a raid coming in soon. So don't want to get too far ahead of myself. Food. Big one. There. Uh, there? I kind of like that. You're going right there. They're going to come from this side to there, got a fire, and from this side to there. So they're all going to hit this side. Okay. This can go away. So here's our experiment. When I demolish this, do we lose all those goods, or do they just drop right on the ground? So demolish, it drops on the ground. So I can demolish this, and the food will drop on the ground, and it'll eventually be carried away. Theoretically. We'll see what actually happens. We've lost a farm. 
And we're going to lose a tree. We have a well right there. And we had good coverage. Probably just didn't have... We have 26 idle people. I've never had 26 idle people before. we got to get them employed. Hmm. Okay. Well, demolish. Not you. We'll demolish you. Drop a farm back in there. Food. Farm. Okay. That's there. I would love to put another orchard in somewhere. We are fertile. Very fertile. Very fertile. Very fertile. 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 Let's take you out. You out. You out. And you guys can drop off at this guy as well. I won't take that out just yet. More fire. Guys. What is with the fire? Put it out. Put it out. Come on. Get to it. <laughs> it survived. Okay. So we have a well right there. He's close enough. That well was close enough too. Though not so close to this. So maybe one more well. Plague is hit. Plague workers are off doing their job. If they've got to this guy, he's fine. They're going to race over to this guy. He's, he's after him right there. Let's follow him in. And he got him. He's off to the next one. He got him. It's like a game of tag. So that's how plagues work here. Let's... All right, there is our... That and that. Okay, food. Let's drop in an orchard. No, we're not going to drop in an orchard. I have to row from both sides, don't I? Because this guy's not going to make it either. Let's town road. One, two, three. And food, orchard, one. Okay, road. I can't put another road right here, can I? I have to make them touch. Town, road, darn. Well, we're talking about going through here. We could, I guess, run across and back into here and do that. That should work. Orchard. Yeah, that'll work there. Okay, that's in. This is in. He's going to get next year's crop. Do we take this out? We could just call that food in the bank. We probably could. Let's take this tree out and put a well there instead of over there. That way they have faster access to it. I like that. I see our market workers or somebody. Interesting. So there probably is nothing in the market so these head of households are just going straight into the granary or looks like even from the fields. Let's put in the other market. Oh. <laughs> yeah. That was going to be a market. Alright. I want a market. Well doesn't have to be. It's kind of a center point to go that way or this way, which means that people who live there could come to each one. That was the thought. But no, we could mark it. Although these areas are farther away from food. That was another idea, another reason. This is as far away from the food as this. Which means this is always going to be empty. Hmm. Another place for a market is where? One, two, three, four doesn't leave room for houses. I'd like to do three cottages right there. That could supply this one if one over here is supplying these guys. That might work. These will tend to go here first, letting that one build up again so these guys can grab from it. I kind of like that. Got a well there too, and we got protection. Mark it. Right there. I don't get the sense that there is a front door. Not really. Yeah, we'll do something like that. That that gabled roof there will be the corner. All right, that's going to go there. Uh, 21 idle employees plus the ones that we just uh, put to work in there. I know you guys have been just itching to tell me something. Hmm. 
You're still talking about how long it takes to get the food in. I know. They're growing unhappy. Churches are too crowded. That's possibly old or possibly relevant. We've added a lot more population. I wonder if it's one church per 100, and we have gone past that point. Could be. Question is, where do we put the next church? The church does have a sphere of influence. It did catch those. It caught most of those. We could church right here. Uh, do that again. We're covering this area just fine. In fact, we can even put another suburb out over here. Yes, we live in the suburbs. Church near the plague workers. Do we road down and over? I kind of like that little diagonal. Make them hop, skip, and jump over the over the puddle over there. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, town, road. Let's claim this territory. Right, there we go. Before we build on it. All the way to here and in. Okay. So those are roads. Another church out in this area. And if I go as far as possible, <clears throat> I may still be able to catch this one. And let us give us the flexibility of heading there or there later. So town, what does the church cost? It was expensive. 85 stone. We do have it. we got 50 wood. Yeah, we can afford it. Now, doubling up on more of the town services. Is there a reason to... Let me flip this guy around. Hmm. Is there a reason to have more than one town square? Do they compound? Probably not. There's only one listing. Okay, I'll tell you what. Let's do this. We'll drop him right here. Though we could put him there. Well, the front door is right into that uh, that hole. But I kind of like the idea of leaving a space between this and those towers. Now we'll do that. These houses are going to have coverage of both churches. Where's church? Zoom in a little bit. That doesn't help. Um, neighbors, town square, nearby church plus eight. Okay. This guy, church. Yeah, they're all under the influence of both churches. Except for him. He only gets one. Plus, okay, church. Down low, right? He does not have church written here. Okay, so it is not counting yet until it's built. So once it's built, we'll see if he's an eight and there's something bigger. Because they'll have two coverages and he'll only have one. That'll be our little test there. Okay. Uh, terrible plague, 18 peasants. None have taken ill thus far. Though we have a little distance to travel this time. So we're going to have to think about a new... Uh, Hospital at some point. What else do we need to do? Food 258. We probably employed a whole new batch who are only journeymen at this point. Okay. There's a, a something to, to kick around or think about as far as shutting down jobs. You're not necessarily going to get a trained person back into that job again. 25 charcoal. Okay, let's get this guy up and running. Stay ahead of that. I was wanting to get into maybe tools soon. Vapor was letting me know in the comments that my question of what is the modifier for a Forester base output of 16, he says it grants you a 10% bonus of uh, if, they, if they are equipped with tools. So Forester, Quarry, and there was a third. Oh, the blacksmith. So, as well as maybe the miners? You know, in other words, we got to put in an iron mine, so I assume that'd be similar to a quarry. Let's... 15 idols. Food. Food is hurting. It really is. Is there anything we can do to help that? Or do we really need a new, uh, new farm system before we go any further? It might be that that's the case. I get the feeling we have an attack coming here real soon. Let's not put food in there. 
That's probably road. That is another food area. Though taking advantage of at least some green. Let's start with this food area first. Well, pause. You're about to go white on me. You just you just pause right there. That set of three, that set of three. We have no dark greens in this area. Do I continue? I really don't want to continue over here because I want to get access to food on both sides of the houses. We need to get into this area. I'm thinking we're going to go to the far one. So we have a little more space to do something else here. Don't know what it is. But let's do that. Let's drop in. And it'll take up the last of our idle peoples. Um, food? No, roads. Roads. Town? Road. To get into here, I'm going to have to go sideways at some point. It's probably this run right here, at least to that. We'll stop there. We'll continue this out to that infertile area. And let's see what that did for us food-wise. It did absolutely nothing. We got that space right there. Okay. How do we logically move our way back into here? We're probably not going to be able to use these spaces. Though I could move the road in here and here. Just have a little, little country garden right there. Hmm. Let's do that. Road. Nope. There, there, there. You go away. Alright, that gets us into here. Town, food, farm. We there yet? We're still not. What am I missing? Well, let's get what we can. And food, one mill, right there, right there. How do I get this space? He comes further over. One, two, three. Okay, that does do it. Town, road. It's two spaces, three spaces after. So what's giving me that one? Apparently plus one this direction. So if I do this, that should give me that one. Let's verify that. Food, farm, there it is. So three spaces over plus one ahead of it is what the, the road will access. All right, so that gives me all of that. I can turn this back on and let her snow. Wow, <laughs> blinded. So another round of food coming in. Did I get you? I did not. Food, farm, there. And I got you, and I got you. All right, that is coming in. We've got a lot of building to do. No idle peoples right now. Everybody is, all the towers are, are manned. With archers and ballasteers. We've got taxes coming in. We've got, we've got happiness coming through the nose. So let's go ahead and tax up a little bit. Targeting now for 85. That's a nice feature. Trending toward 85. I like that. 85 is enough to keep us fully housed. One idle. Because the roads are all done. And as these are built, they're going to start becoming employed. So is everything turned back on? It is not. We still have this right here, and I was going to talk about doing this. Which one? I'm thinking we'll always be hurting for wood. So let's say this guy will take iron and... Nope, not you. This one. Where do we want the iron to go? The process of making tools is going to take our charcoal. So I'm thinking the charcoal storage is the one that's never going to fill up. So we'll put iron and charcoal into this one. And let's put an iron mine over here. And I think it's time to shut this episode down. I've been on a break for the last couple of months. And I'm not in the habit of using my timer anymore. It's a little app that's attached to Chrome that I can see over my other monitor off to the left. And I, I turned it on for an episode... Oh, probably the episode one of this series. <laughs> and I was shocked what I saw. I didn't turn it off after the last one I made back in February what, before I took the break. There was 67 days, 20-some hours and some minutes and seconds stacked up on that poor little clock that had been running all this time in the background. Iron Mine. So, <laughs> let me know how long I've been on break. 
So that guy is waiting. Builders two of five. We'll have an iron mine for next time. We will have four, three ballast, ballast deer towers, ballast ballista towers, ready to take on the next ogre. Which I'm sure there's at least one coming, if not three. And here it comes. All right. Pause. This is for next time. So we've got a new farm area being built. Will be manned. We need to well it. Let's get the well in. Town well. You over there? We're actually fairly decent already. So well right there. Otherwise, we've not added anything else that we need wells in. No, we're good over here. I'm going to intentionally not look at the ships. I'll leave that as a surprise for next time. Got our other market in. Five people are there. And 82 out of 75 food. So that worked out well. The food is back in the 300s. Excellent. Or as Vapa would say, brilliant. And 140 out of 200. So they're taken out of here. And church is back on again. We do need another church. No, we've got that being built. All right, let's focus in on that. As a reminder, we're building the church. All right, then. We survived again. We survived to, to play another day. This has been Noble Rambler. Thank you guys for watching. Leave comments below. Let me know what you think and where we should be headed next. Anything I'm missing? Any questions I had that you have the answers for? I always appreciate that. And I guess we'll call this one done. Catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.